Hey everyone, welcome back to Lumber Capital Log Yard. In today's video, I'm going to be going more in depth about quarter sawing and what causes the much sought after ray fleck pattern. Before we begin, remember to like and subscribe and follow us on Instagram at lumbercapital07. Also, check out our merch shop by clicking on the link in the description down below. People have different opinions as to what the exact quarter sawn angle is. Some define it as between 60 and 90 degrees, while some say that it is between 75 and 90 degrees. There are several ways that you can achieve this kind of angle. I have only tried a few of them. Make sure to watch my other video on quarter sawing if you are interested in how it is cut. Most of the small wood cells in a tree run vertically in the log, moving fluids up from the roots. A few cells run in and out of the bark to the center of the stem or radially. These cells that primarily store starches and sugars in the tree are called ray cells. With a flat sawn piece of lumber, the end of the ray cells are exposed on the face of the lumber and generally do not have too much of an effect on the appearance of the face. Short, vertical lines if any. However, on quarter sawn lumber, the sides of the ray cells are running parallel to the face. This side view creates an interesting pattern in so many species of hardwood lumber, oak especially. The appearance of ray cells in quarter sawn lumber is called ray fleck. In fact, the standard definition of quarter sawn lumber for many species is that the ray fleck must be obvious. The appearance of this pattern is of course what makes this lumber incredibly sought after by many artists and furniture makers. That and it is extremely strong because of the grain formation.
So why have we chosen to quarter saw? Well, quarter sawn lumber is incredibly time consuming to cut. That is part of why it's so expensive. The boss has always wanted to cut hardwoods, but there is just no way of competing with the huge mills in that niche. The main reason why we have started is because we believe that we can sell it at a competitive price for a better quality. Also, with the ability to kiln dry, we are left with a very hard to come by product. At least in our area. That's it for this week's video. If you liked it, remember to like and subscribe and follow us on Instagram at LumberCapital07. If you have any video ideas you would like to see in the future, make sure to leave it in the comment section down below.